and today we're looking at the uh, PVC fence um, from Timeless Fence Systems. Um, in this particular demonstration, we have installed over 5,800 feet of PVC fence. About 4,900 feet of that is a four strand high tensile electric wire. And then about 950 feet is a two strand cross fence. Um, what I wanted to show right here, this is um, one of the H braces in the system. We have um, installed on this site a four foot, a six foot, and an eight foot H brace system. All of them used with a bracing wire. And um, if you kind of come to the corner post right here and you grab it, and you sit there and pull it and it's very stout. Uh, I'd almost compare it to a wooden post. Now you go out to the end of the H and one thing you're going to see is flexibility. And of course we want to remember this is not a steel post or wooden post. It's PVC and it's going to have flexibility. But the one thing I wanted to point out is, is this functional? Is it practical? Does it serve the purpose? So the main purpose of an H brace is to be able to tighten up your high tensile wire and your strength is in line with your fence. So I can sit here and pull this thing and, and tug on it pretty tight and it's, uh, it's very stout. Also a couple of things that we demonstrated, we use a gripple here to tighten up the brace wire. And then over here we used a, a strainer. So there are just a couple of options that, uh, that we wanted to show. Also, we have some, uh, some crimps that were put on here uh, to, to begin our, our run on our wire. And also over here, we hand tied the wire. I don't know if we can get a good look at that, but um, we've, we've just hand tied it. This is 170,000 PSI class 3 galvanized high tensile wire so it's very easy to tie and uh, and you can do a real nice looking job like i said we also have these crimps and in this case right here we use a crimp and a little jumper just to continue our energy flow all right wanted to show uh, another option on the bracing uh, this is called an a brace and um, uh, one thing I haven't mentioned yet is that this is an H beam and so we have um, there's two A braces here and and they are bolted together they are 30 inches in the ground with one bag of quick creep also in the, the leg I'll call the leg here this 45 degree angle it's 30 inches in the ground with a bag of concrete and then you can see we just have a piece of tubing right here for, for a little bit of strength. So again, we're looking at a, a corner here. This also can be used as an end without the extra A right here. And when we sit here and, and grab it and tug it as hard as you can, it hardly moves. So another, another great option for, um, for a corner or for an end uh, along with the H brace. Now we also have an, um, a place where we've used an H and an A. We tried to do as many uh, options as we could for the demonstration. But just wanted to show you this is an, an A brace right here and uh, it works works very well for a corner or, or the end on a uh, fencing run.